Hello everybody, my name is Zaylu and Happy New Year. We are going to start this 2018 right with some Would You Rather. Um, I what I don't know what better thing to do than play some Would You Rather for the New Year's Day uh, release. But, uh, I mean, we started off on a stellar question already. Uh, would you rather be a Slytherin or be a Gryffindor? But before I do go into that or anything like that, I'm wanting to make this new year an absolute great, great year. Um, I feel like 2018 is going to be our year, you guys. And um, I just want to thank everybody again for sticking with me through hard times, through slow times in my YouTube. Uh, you guys are absolutely fantastic, and I can't wait to start doing tons more videos. But without further ado, we are going to get in this to this. Would you rather? Um, I want to. I want to do. I just. I don't know what it was. I just felt compelled to do this for the New Year's. Uh, but before then, I'm going to scroll down just a tad bit. Uh, just, just a tad bit. T -t -t uh, oh, there we go. That's what I wanted. Um, would you rather be a Slytherin or be a Gryffindor? My dilemma here is I absolutely love Gryffindor. I'm a Gryffindor in everything. Um, on the Pottermore website, I'm a Gryffindor. On every single test that I take, I am a Gryffindor. Um, I love Slytherin. Don't get me wrong, Slytherin's a great house, but uh, I am I'm always a Gryffindor. I love Gryffindor. The the thing is, most of my friends are Slytherins, um, and my girlfriend is a Slytherin, and uh, she's a diehard Slytherin fan. But I'm gonna go with being a Gryffindor because that's just what I am. I I I it was my destiny to be a Gryffindor. And 73% of you feel like you want to be a Gryffindor too because Slytherin is evil. It's bad. It's just bad, alright? Would you rather talk a little bit too loud or talk a little bit too soft? Um, for this one, I actually want to be a little louder so that uh, my mic will pick me up a little bit more. So, uh, for YouTube reasons... Uh, talking a bit too loud is actually a good thing because if you talk a little bit too loud, you still get, to, but if you talk a little too soft, it's very difficult to hear you and everything like that. So I'm going to go with a bit too loud just because, well, that's my natural volume, uh, even though it's going to annoy everyone. Everyone I meet, it's going to annoy. I, I didn't even care what the reason was. I just, it was, it was my destined to be a little bit too loud. All right, would you rather be known as the all-time greatest mathematician or writer? Um, I really did not like math in school, so I'm going to go with writer in this because I really like writing. Um, I did write a couple of stories that I did not like publish or anything like that. It was just stories that I liked to do in school. Uh, but I'd much rather be a writer. Uh, not too great with the maths. Uh, so, yeah, writer, why not? Ooh. All right, here's a question. Would you rather live the life of Amy Pond with the Doctor in the TARDIS or live uh, your life alongside Sam and Dean Win Winchester and the Impala? Uh, so, this is a, well, this is a kind of easy one because I'm not a girl, so Amy Pond would not be the greatest choice for me. But uh, I'm going to I'm gonna switch out Amy Pond. I'm just... Uh, whose companion would you be? I'm just gonna take out Amy Pond and just put myself in this. So it's just me uh, living the life with Doctor Who or me living my life with Sam and Dean Winchester. So this is difficult because I love both shows. Supernatural is a great show and Doctor Who is one of my, the greatest shows too, uh, for, in my eyes. Uh, so I don't, this is a very difficult question for me because I love both of them, but I think... I'd rather go into the life of the Doctor because um, time travel has always been a very fascinating subject in my eyes. Um, and with Sam and Dean Winchester, it's just kind of demons and stuff and more chances for me to turn evil. So I'm going to go with uh, the Doctor in this one. Oh man, I was in the majority on that one. Good thing I'm not doing the Bean Boozle challenge or else I would have to eat some crappy skunk or sock or vomit. It's gross. That was the grossest idea I've ever had. 
Would you rather eat fruit or eat vegetables? Now, this one's kind of weird because uh, I like both of them more than I do uh, with meats. So, is this... Like, I can only eat fruit and vegetables, I'm guessing. Uh, I can live off of that. Uh, I would rather go with fruit because I feel like it has more taste than vegetables. Although, I still love pretty much all vegetables. Actually, yeah, I think I love every single vegetable. Uh, I don't like all fruits. Uh, I don't like pineapple and coconut. But, I don't, I don't know why. <laughs> Those are the only two that I do not like in fruit. But, I think fruit has a little bit more tastes than vegetables. Uh, vegetables are just kind of... They taste green. I don't know why. I don't know what... What? Oh my god. <laughs> so many people. It's not even the reason that I don't like vegetables. It's just the fact that I feel like it just doesn't have as much taste as fruit. <laughs> and I love fruit. <laughs> so, yeah. I don't know. I, I guess fruit would be the best choice out of pretty much everybody. Um, well, I'm in the majority. Awesome. Here's a good question. Would you rather meet your idol or be popular at school? Since I'm not really in school, I'm going to kind of base this off of like when I was in school. Um, and the thing was, I wasn't like, I wasn't in high school, I guess. I wasn't like, you know, treated any differently than everybody else uh my high school like went, um what was a different story when i went back to high school i went i went to a homeschool for a, a little while and then i went back to public school and i was like i i just knew everybody like i could talk to anybody uh no one was like you know oh i'm the popular i mean there was like you know the popular crowd and stuff like that but no one really was like treated like, we, they didn't really treat me in any different way than everybody else. Uh, we just kind of just got through it. And we're like, you know what? This is like, this is when we start our lives. So I, we might as well just get through it all together and just go. Uh, but w w even with that, like, if I wanted to be the popular kid in school, um, I, I, I'd rather actually meet my idol because my idol was a youtuber i he is a youtuber uh, i would i i i'm thinking of it like i want i'm gonna meet markiplier he's he's my youtube idol uh like and i would totally love to meet mark uh he seems like a very cool dude and i feel like our uh we would get along very well with just talking uh so i'd rather actually meet my idol than be the popular kid in school um and actually, a lot of you agree with me. I thought I was actually going to be a little bit lower on the, on that scale because I don't know. Well, I don't know how, how many people play this uh, that's not in high school or anything like that. But I I don't know. I wanted to meet my idol. I've been, I've wanted to meet my idol forever. And there's a Facebook notification. That's kind of cool. Fun fun things right there. But yeah, <laughs> but yeah, no. I'd rather meet my idol. I think uh, that'd be super cool to do that and like being popular in school it's it's not gonna matter in a couple of years so like i'm like ah oh, whatever i'll just meet my idol <laughs> all right so next question so here's an interesting one if you could only have one would you rather have facebook or twitter that is a very interesting question um i this is a difficult one because I don't really use Facebook any, uh, much anymore, but I also don't tend to keep up on my Twitter. But um, if I had to choose one, I would probably actually pick Twitter just because I feel like if I only had Twitter to uh, for my social medias, I would probably use it a lot more often, which I should. And I'm sorry that I haven't. And I know some of you, you know, tried to talk to me through Twitter. I just, I, I, I always forget that I have it. And I'm just like, ah, this, whatever. But I also do that with my Facebook. I don't really use it that often. I use the Messenger a lot more than I do Facebook. Uh, but... Uh, if I didn't have Facebook, does that include not having Messenger? I guess I could just call my friends, like, or just text a group with a group chat or something like that. I don't know. I think I'd rather have Twitter, because if I only had Twitter, I would probably keep up on it more. So I'm going to go with Twitter. I'm sure, yeah, 70. I, I knew I was going to be in the less majority of that. 
uh, but I feel like if I only had, I don't even, I don't even like social media too much. I like YouTube. That's a social media kind of, but that's like the only social media that I really like. <laughs> Everything else, I'm just like, yeah, it's whatever. Instagram, I'll post uh, maybe once every two months or so. <laughs> I'm just, I don't know. I, I've kind of, it's just kind of a thing that it's, I don't do too often anymore, which I should be doing way more often. I mean, I will. I'm gonna 2018. I'm gonna. Every day, Twitter, every day, the like and subscribe. <laughs> All right, and another Facebook notification. God. <laughs> All right, next question. All right, here is the last and final question. On December 21st, December, sorry, 21st, 2012, would you rather have the uh, uh, zombie apocalypse or an alien invasion as your doomsday? I'm going to leave this one up to you guys. Uh, personally, I would probably want... Um, I don't know. I don't know which one I would want, actually. I don't like aliens at all. Like, I really don't like aliens. But I feel like in the zombie apocalypse, I would probably be a zombie. So, either one, I'm pretty much SOL. Uh, so, I don't know which one I would choose. I'd probably go more towards the zombie apocalypse and just end it there. Um, but I don't know. Uh, what would you guys choose? Tell me down in the comment section below. But anyway, thank you guys so much for sticking with me through this year. This year was a kind of a year I was stuck in a rut, uh, and a year I also was just kind of unmotivated and unconfident. And this is, I think, the last time I'm going to talk about this. Uh, it might be. So I've been talking about this with a few videos that are going to be coming out, and I'm, I'm going to apologize now, but this is the last time because it's, it's going to be a new year, new me type thing. Um, I, I, 2018, I want to make my year. Like I want to, I want to, I want to try more in 2018. And I want to thank the people that have stuck with me so far. Um, we are going to surpass 2000. Uh, I'm going to, I'm going to do everything in my power to surpass 2000 and just get, get more out there and try to make more people smile and just, have a good time with it. Like I, I, I love doing this. I love doing this stuff for you guys. So I want to, I'm just, I'm going to keep that mindset. Just be like, Hey, I want to have a good time. And that's what I'm going to do. But anyway, thank you guys again so much for sticking with me through this stuff. We had some amazing games this year uh, to play and I've, st I've finished all of them. I finished all of them, so they're coming out. They're coming out soon, I promise. I just gotta edit all of them. It takes time to edit. Uh, I, I've finished Resident Evil 7. I finished, you know, The Evil Within 2. I have, uh, I've started something uh, uh, back up, and we'll see which one that is soon. Uh, and I've started a couple other games, so Thank you guys so much for, for sticking with me through this 2017 experience. I hope you guys have an absolutely wonderful next year, uh, 2008, or I mean this year, I guess, because this is coming out when it's 2018. Yeah. So thank you guys again so much for watching and thank you guys for so much for sticking with me. I, I, I love doing this and um, I didn't know, I didn't know what to do for a new year special thing so i just decided with uh would you rather because would you rather was kind of like a staple on this channel i guess um i i so yeah that's exactly what it was <laughs> yeah so anyway thank you guys again so much for watching and have a wonderful new year uh be safe be responsible and i guess i will see you in the next video Thank you again so much for watching. Thank you again so much for being here. Thank you uh, for the amazing support in 2017. And I'll see you in the next one. Peace.